Hey guys and welcome back. My name is Tishy. If you're new, welcome. And if you came back for part three, thank you so much for the support. I know there was a huge delay in this video and I hope I'm forgiven. Um, but going straight into it. So as you can see here, this was me just cleaning up. If you haven't watched part one and two, I highly suggest uh, you looking at these in order to get a better idea of the flat. I'll share these above as well so you can just be able to click through it. So in this video, I'm going to share with you the outcomes of the bedroom in the living room flooring, and I hope you enjoy. And a girl has a juicy story, so wait for that as well. So, the story about me almost not having a carpet is peak. So, I decided to use a local um, carpet company in order to have the carpet fitted because I didn't want to go to like any other like expensive places, I guess. So, what happened was the I was booked by the company for a carpet uh, for a carpet fitter to come um, because they're usually freelance actually. So I had an argument with the guy the day before because he had said he had come to the house and apparently no one was in the house, which was a lie because we were actually in the house. And I remember him going, being like so pissed off and almost like cussing me um, and was like, I'm not even going to come into your house like he hung up the phone. So then obviously I had to go back to the company, tell them like, yo, I've spoken to the um, carpet fit and it was really rude. So I need this sorted out because I need my carpet to be fitted. So obviously now it had to be a bit of back and forth between the company owner and the car carpet fitter. Um, but yeah, so after that, like he still came because we had to have like some sort of an agreement um in terms of what happened so yeah so anyway he still came um but he came with someone else to help so it was actually done so the appointment was one hour but i feel like it was done within like 45 minutes because it was two of them so which is good and i actually did enjoy the outcome because sometimes if you do have arguments with these people like you can like probably regret it because they'll probably do it as bad as to spies you so yeah The next part is the living room. So this was how it looked like way before we even took out this carpet that we found. And this was how we got the laminate flooring. And this was from b q which I'll link down below as well. The first thing I'm going to say 
is always have backup like always have two people who you can rely on in terms of this whole flooring situation because i had one on the day no picking up no text nothing didn't even like have the courtesy thing or saying i'm not turning up and yeah i had to start from square one i had to go on some website trying to look for a freelance and it was long so thank god for this guy he was quite local and um he was really lovely as well gave us bare stories about the area and um yeah he came on a sunday so he had actually come to check the house on the saturday just to see how it was and see what he's working with which was really good and then yeah he came saturday morning did it like within i want to say two three hours and the only thing i will say that was kind of bad at the end was because we had bought nine packets of the, the whole laminate flooring and he actually used um eight and like because i returned one so which was not open but the eighth one was like it not meant to be opened but he messed up one of the plaques and then had to take out from the eighth pack which was quite annoying because i actually wanted to return it and now i just have it in the house just chilling so yeah um so anyway always have a backup that's one thing i'll always say because yeah this it drove me mad and this is how the floor turned out and i am so happy with the result thank you so much for watching the video uh watch out for part four where i'll then show you guys the bathroom and the kitchen and how also that looked and another juicy story of that whole situation like share subscribe and watch out for part four